What's up, class? Today we're testing our drawing skills in Roblox School by attempting to draw the perfect circle. And spoiler alert, it's way harder than it looks. So let's see who's gonna be the best in class. Me, the goat, Sunny Boy, or will it be my brother, the smelly watermelon? Comment your predictions now. And also check out our store, sunnyandmelon.com, for our adorable big plushies. Melon, we're in class, and our job today is to try and draw the perfect circle. Sunny, this is gonna be the hardest thing we've ever done. I don't know. Check out the sample drawing on screen. Looks like Mr. Lionel Messi's doing work. That is the farthest thing from a circle I've ever seen. Bro, he's just drawing in the entire chalkboard. That's his solution. I'm up. Check this technique out, Sonny. Yeah. Yo, what? 75%? That's not bad. Hey, I'll take it. 73.98%. Try and beat that, Sonny. Bro, you can keep trying. Oh, wait, what? 87? What? 88%? How, Melon? That's insane. It's like you were born as a round spherical wander. Yes, I was, Sonny. But I was actually more of an oval. That's why I couldn't hit the perfect 100%. Well, the good news is I was born as the sun, which is the ultimate sphere in our solar system. Sonny, you'll forever be second and third place. Wait, why are you a bacon hair on this leaderboard? 45? Don't bruh me! How is that 47? Yikes, Sonny. 33%? How did you get 88? That's ridiculous! Yeah, I'm not even gonna lie. Mine looked way worse than yours. That is so cap. Whatever. There's another player who's about to cry me a river and draw a circle. But I think they rage quit after they saw you get 88. Because I'm a goat, sonny. I'm gonna win the very first competition. Whatever. It's only because I was a noob this round. It won't happen again. Let's go. I won, sonny. And goats, when it's Melon's turn, I'm gonna hit him with the jump scare. Oh, it's me. It's me. Singer 39. 85! Dang it. You're actually doing really well. I still got a decent score. Just wait till I'm up, sonny. You're gonna see some goat to drawing. Yeah, like this one, 20%. No, at least 80% more than 20%. Yeah, so like 28%. You'll see, Sonny. Check my new strategy out, boom. Yes, you're going slow and steady. Let's see it. That was not good. Ah! Sonny, stop! I can't see! I didn't do nothing! I know you did that. Dang it! I've gotta beat you! No! And wait, I lost! Dang it! By 1%! Not even! 0.3%, bruh. That's karma. What? Whatever. I'm starting us off fresh this round with an 86. Guys, do you see this glitch? I can draw on other people's circles? Give me this. Give me this right now. Come on. I need to get a really high score. 89.8%. That's a new record. Dang it. Bro, you're not topping that. Someone needs to get 90% if they're going to beat my perfect circle. Guys, don't understand. How does this glitch pencil even work? I guess we're going to find out when I draw my perfect circle. All right. It's time for me to draw. Wait, why can't I draw? What the heck? Bro, what are you doing? That looks like trash. Check this out. I've unplugged my map. Oh, no. That was a bad idea. Nope. That was really bad. What are you doing? Stop spamming my screen. That's not me. That's this person. I'm tired of it every single time I go up there. I swear I didn't do anything. Yes, you did. You know you did it. I actually didn't. And I got video proof. I was just chilling over here. And these other two were pranking you. Urgh, that's it. I'm practicing my circles. But Melon, now that I've taken the new high score, I shall treat myself to a lovely crayon because it's got hearts on it. Yeah. Well, mine's way cooler than yours, Sonny. Yeah, you bought this one. It says, glitch other player circles. I swear if you cheese me with that thing. Doesn't even work. I don't understand. Are you clicking on the wall? Yes. Nothing's happening? Yeah, nothing's happening. Good. It's what you deserve. All right, I'm up. I swear if I get freaking angered again. Melon, you're not gonna get angered, but you're not getting a 90 percenter either. Stop! No! <laughs> oh, bro, not even an 80 percent score. Sad. Bro! I'm supposed to be able to draw a perfect circle. I've had one opportunity to do that. 89 again, baby. You don't know what it's like. You don't know what it's like. No, what's like? Ah, bro, what? That was so weird. You'll never get to 90%. Yeah, but I still have the high score, bro. 89.3. Get on my level. Yeah, maybe don't troll me for one round. How about that? Maybe I get a round where I can actually draw the whole time. When did I ever troll you? How did you get to go again? Well, it's a new round, obviously, silly. And it lets the champ go first. Oh, that was bad. Come on, 90%. No, I need a 90! You know what? That's okay. 
We'll take that. 88. I'm gonna count to 11 teen, and then I'm gonna press kill drawer. <sighs> You're so annoying. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 11 teen. And time to press kill the drawer now. Hopefully it's not you, Melon. Kill the drawer, Sonny. I already did. Nobody exploded. They're not even in here. Thank goodness. Now it's my turn to draw the circle soon. I guess I gotta rebuy it then. No! Nobody died. What, bro? Sonny! Killing you... the drawer. Oh my goodness. Yeah! Yeah, explosions, epic! I quit. I'm out of here. Wait, no, Mel Melon, where are you going? I'm done. I can't even play the game. What's the point of me being there? Admit it, then. You don't know how to draw a circle. No, I never even had a chance to draw a circle. Anyways, goats, that's how you draw a perfect circle and make your brother rage quit. Now, if you want to learn how to draw the perfect circle, you should start by circling that like button and pressing it right now. Let's go. Also, our big plushies are kind of like circles. You can get them now on Sunny and Melon. Today I'm spending thousands of Robux to complete this zombie bunker tycoon. Watch us go from this poopy house to this ultimate bunker. Melon, today we each have to build a bunker to survive against these zombies. Let's get started with our basement. All right, Sonny, I've constructed it. But ah, I'm getting chased by a speedy zombie. What the heck? That right, sucks to be you. I'm pretty safe down here. I just got a research station. Ellie, Ellie, help me. Oh my goodness. Some random player just shotgunned that zombie and saved me. I am completing a DNA sequence. Melon. And with this, I will get paid. I don't understand how you're doing all this, Sonny. I'm gonna be honest. It's because I'm not a noob like you. I'm on my computer conducting important research, Melon. Oh, yeah. I've got to connect the DNA strands. Yes, but of course. Yes, give me another pink strand, yellow, uh, green, and blue. When am I gonna get paid, though? I feel like I've clicked on 10 of these. Where's my money? Melon, when do you get paid for this? Tell me. You have to uh, complete it. I realize you have to do it in a color sequence. Yeah, I've done like 10 of them. I'm not stupid. What do you mean? Of course you have to do a color sequence. This is like a Mogus. Well, I'm stupid, and I didn't know that. Hey, I got paid. You just had to do a lot of them. Now, what's going on up here? I conducted a whole lot of research, and with that research, I can spawn a vehicle. Yo, I got a rusty bike, and I'm driving my rusty bike to deliver the research. Yo, the scientist better pay me. I need that money. I sold the research melon. I got 19 buckarooskies. I'm basically rich. Tony, I'm still doing this. Do I get booted off the computer? Oh, there we go. Yeah, you gotta do 10 sequences. Dude, did you make a ton of money? Oh, yeah, a lot. I got 19 whole dollars. Also, yo, Melon, check me out, brother. I'm gonna shoot you. Yo, chill, sonny. You ain't shooting nothing. Can it kill you? Oh, that would be awesome. I've just gotta bike past these zombies and do the exact same thing you just did. And also, sonny, can you let me know what I'm supposed to do with this? What do you mean? Do I get a gun? No, oh, you just sell it to the scientists over there. It's pretty easy. And then we have to do that all over again? Yep. I'm gonna take out some zombies, though. I wanna get paid. Maybe they'll drop some moolah. Oh, Oh, yeah, they definitely drop moolah. Taking the giant down. How much money? Bro, that was way more cash than doing research. Yeah, I'm just gonna shoot some zombies for a bit. Yeah, that is crazy, dude. Pay up, zombie. I'm doing drive-bys on these zombies in a bike. Nice. I think this guy's gonna steal my kills, isn't he? Melon, the giant zombies pay a lot more than the regulars. The brutes? No, the giants. I don't think I've seen a single giant. I got $250 now. I gotta get this zombie off my house. Yo, get away from this. Yeah, I got money to spend. I'm gonna go into my basement and make a few purchases. Oh yeah. I just killed myself a giant. Nice work. I just got myself one researcher. Make it two researchers. Make it uh, three researchers. No way. How do you have that kind of economic funds? Actually, I have four researchers. Oh wait, no. I upgraded his equipment. You know what? That was worth it. And an armory. Yo, this game looks awesome. Well, Melon, my researchers are hard at work collecting me some data. I'm gonna pick it up now. Bro, I can only afford one researcher. You are a Broke E. I have finished the tutorial now. Congratulations, Sonny. Thank you. I'm doing a little bit of extra research myself the old-fashioned way. Ooh, yes. Yep, that's good. I'll take these papers. That's 9 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Time to go sell this to the scientists. Melon, you having fun over there? Yeah, I'm trying to figure out how to uh, unlock my cursor. Yeah, I think I messed up big time. I might have to rejoin as well. I was in the shift lock mode when I stepped on the vehicle spawn point. This is bad. Oh, wait, I got rid of it. I got rid of it. You just gotta get unequip your gun and then unshift lock. Oh, you're a genius. And now I'll ride my bicycle to the scientist. Time to make some money. Yeah, well, Shenny does all that hard work. I'm just gonna buy $2,000 real quick for 520 Robux. And now with this, goats, I shall buy researchers. I need more researchers. Take this. Oh my goodness. They have five at a time. Let me upgrade my equipment here. Yes. Laser gate, of course. Upgrade carry capacity. Oh yeah, that's what I needed. Now, goats, I carry 40 research papers at a time. I'm gonna 
make so much freaking money. I found it. I've been searching far and wide for another giant. Now I'll take it out and get paid stacks. Wait, what? Only 72? Last time I got over 200 for that. Yeah, I don't know, Sonny. Dang it. Oats, Willie does that. I'll get another researcher. And I'll even invest in the armory. Yo, what's in here? Oh, I could get myself a Glock 18. Don't mind if I do. All right, make me rich, giant. That was not making me rich. And just like that, I have ran out of money. Ah, <sighs> Melon, I got 200 buckarooskies. I gotta go invest it now. I need more researchers. Yeah, bro. Also, Melon, how do you increase your carrying capacity? Oh, yeah, to do that? It costs quite a bit, Sonny. It's an upgrade. All right, let me see. I'm back in my house. Let's take a look. Right now, I can carry 40. No way. What? I can only still do 10. Just got to get that upgrade, Sonny. A few times. Ah, there we go. Upgrade my carrying capacity. I can hold 20 of them. And now I'm going to sell 35 research papers. And I collected over 100 buckarooskies. Dang it, bro. That's insane. At least I have 20. Come on, finish your job. Finish your gerb. And after I sell these research papers, I'm not going to... A cap melon, it's time for me to do some pay to win. Oh, yeah, I already did some pay to win, Sonny. Are you kidding me? And then I got one shotted by a brute. You are welcome. That doesn't make sense, dude. How's this guy that strong? He kills you in one hit. All right, let me go sell my research papers. Melon, how's your base coming along? Is your tycoon looking good? It's looking pretty good. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. I just need someone to automatically sell the research. Is there a game pass for that? If you get a game pass for that, I need to buy it too because that's gonna be broken. Let's see, uh, game passes. Nope, I can't do that, unfortunately. Sell my 20 papers. There we go. I got some cash now. And with this newfound cash, as I walk back to my house, I'm going to check out the shop. <gasps> Look at these game passes. That's crazy. Double the carry. Yeah, we need that. That's for sure. Excellent. One purchase acquired. Purchase number two. Money, money, money. Ooh, double the money for 30 minutes? Yes, please. I need that right now. And I think a little cash injection wouldn't hurt. So I will also spend 1,000 Robux to get $5,000. Okay, Melon, I did my pay to win. I feel good now. I have a feeling you did a lot more pay to win than I did. Nah, nah, nah. Don't be silly now. Don't be silly. Goats, I'm gonna buy a new vehicle. The e-bike. Yes. Then I'm gonna buy another new vehicle. The quad. Yes. Perfect. I'm happy with my vehicle upgrades, but what I'm not happy with is my research station. I gotta go downstairs and upgrade all of my employees. There you go. Another one. Another upgrade. Yes. More capacity. All right, Melon, I'm feeling pretty good about my set up now. I won't cap. Well, good for you, Sonny. I'm not gonna cap. I bought this 2x inventory space and it did not work. Oh, I can carry 100 papers now. Is that what you mean? Bro, what the heck? I can only carry 40 still. Oh, unlucky, dude. Are you sure it activated? I'm pretty sure I bought it. Well, I've got a whole bunch of researchers grinding here. This is nice. I feel like I'm living the good life. And I can upgrade my walking speed? That's awesome. I need to get a lot more of those. All right, I'm on my e-bike. This at least makes things go a little bit quicker. There we go. 54 papers. I'm gonna get to 100 papers and then do a big sell-off. Yeah, that's probably the move, but unfortunately, I can't do that. I'm selling off 40 papers for $400. Nice work, Melon. I'm also gonna buy a Glock 18 for 80 bucks. Let's go. This thing better be strong. Yeah, I have myself a Glock 18. I'm taking out this giant now. Come on, you better pay me big time. Giant, you gotta go down. Die! Okay, you gave me 100 bucks. It's pretty good. Nice. And I officially have 100 papers to sell. This better make me bank. Oh no, there's a lot of zombies outside my house right now. Die, giant. This gun doesn't even feel that good. I think someone stole my kill. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to do a little more pay to win. Let's go here. For 1,500 Robux, I will buy $10,000. Yes. And now with this, I'll make some massive upgrades. Wait a second. No way. I can store stuff in my quad. Wait, actually? Yeah, I could put 60 papers in there. Bro, that's busted. That is awesome. I'm gonna definitely take advantage of that after I sell these 100 off. Bro, I just burnt through 10k like it was nothing. I'm gonna invest in some money upstairs and see what happens. Removing all these boards. Is it just cosmetic or is there some value add? I don't know. I can get a kitchen, a plant. Uh, might as well get this turret. No way. You have a turret in your house? Yeah, bro. It's pretty strong too. I bet you it will melt zombies. But now I'm out of money. I just burnt through that like it was nothing. Yeah, I'm about to burn through 600. I can't even burn through it. I could only buy a researcher. Bro! <gasps> Automatic collection system for 1200! I need that. Where did you see that? Once you 
buy enough researchers, it'll offer it to you. Oh my goodness, I need to get more. So, I might as well spend another 1,500 Robux. Melon, let me guess, you're doing more pay to win. No, I would never do such a thing. I would never do. Give me this, researcher. Upgrade equipment. Researcher. Upgrade equipment. Researcher. Upgrade equipment. Automatic collection system. Acquired! Whatever. I'm gonna store 60 research papers in my quad, and I'm gonna go collect another 100. Yeah, and it's time for me to upgrade my vehicle quite handsomely. Let's go over here. Yeah, why not? Let's get a container carrier for 2,500. Let's go! How much can I store in here? Oh my goodness, I can store 1,100 papers. That's insane! You probably think you're good at the video game or something. Well, I probably do think because I am. Well, whatever. I have 68, 71. I got a lot of papyrus to sell here soon, and then I'll be rich. It is a bit of a grind, though. I won't even cap. There is a lot of work to do in this game if we want to get our bunkers upgraded. And I just acquired myself a second floor. We're going deeper. Treadmill analyzer. Whoa, I'm analyzing these zombies' brains. Bro, you and I both know you bought more cash. There's no way you got that upgraded already. Oh, yeah, I bought like 20,000 in cash. Are you kidding me? Whatever. I just made a thousand buckarooskies at least without having to cheat. Well, good for you, Sonny. And I have enough to buy the auto collection now. But, goats, I kind of feel like it's time I do some cheating of my own. Let's buy $10,000. Oh, I'm getting attacked. This is bad. Phew. Killed that speedy zombie. And it's time to make some investments. Let's start by upgrading this equipment down here and grabbing those papers. Everybody looks full, so it's time for auto collection. Yo, look at this thing go. It's pretty slow. Grab the papers. Oh, yeah, this thing's trash. Maybe it'll be good once it actually gets started. I gotta clear out all these ones that are already full. Okay, I'm gonna drop off these papers. I have 263. How much am I gonna get paid for this? Let's make our way downtown to the researcher to sell our research and make money. Oh, uh, Melon, question for you, though. How the heck did you get to 2,000 capacity? Oh, I didn't, dude. My car holds 1,100. It killed me. Oh, thank goodness I got to pay. What the heck? That zombie one-shotted me. All right, I'm gonna kill these two giants out here. Maybe they'll make me extra money. And my research paper better still be in my car. If it's not, I'm done, skis. Yeah. Also, like you said, this auto collector is very slow. And then you have to pick up the box yourself at the end of it anyway. Yeah, it's not very nice. Let me grab it, consume it, and there's still more in here. I'm gonna go put it on my quad. Oh, yeah. I just made some good money. 2.1 thousand off that. Dang, bro. You're progressing faster than me, which means it's time for me to buy the second floor. Going deeper. Deeper into the basement and buying the analyzer. Bro, how many analyzers do you have? I think I have all of them. I got quite a few. I got like five or six or something. Yeah, but then you still gotta manually collect all this stuff. Yeah, it's part of the game, Sonny. Oh no, I might die here. Can you guys stay away from me and my car? Please. Oh my goodness, I gotta get away. The zombie treadmills create research way faster than the computers do. Bro, I'm getting hunted down by zombies. I need to get in my turret right now and take them out. Um, okay, that worked pretty well. And I need to go sell off my research papers. 200 of them. Make me that money. Oh, that is nice. I think I'm gonna buy some weapons with this cash. Sonny, how'd you get out of your computer? I don't know. I just jumped. I can't. I'm stuck. Let me move my cursor. Well, I guess you're just trash. This is so annoying. I think I have to reset my character or something. Don't worry, Melon. I'm expanding the walls so I can get more treadmills. But to do that, I'll have to buy more cash. And I think Melon bought 20,000 cash, so I'll do the same. Bro, I reset my character and I'm just not respawning. Oh, poor Melon. There we go. Finally. Yes, I got the automatic collection here. And I'm gonna scoop all these papers up. Holy moly. Inventory full already. Bro, everything is filling up. I need more capacity. Yeah, I think I need to invest in some more capacity as well. Let me see here. Spawn vehicle. Scroll to the bottom. <laughs> the tank. Wait, it's only 250 storage. How do you have a vehicle with 2,000 storage? 1,100 storage, Sonny. That makes no sense. I'm literally buying a tank, which is pay to win, and it only has 250. Sonny, the one that costs 2,500 in-game dollars is actually better. How do I even store stuff in the tank? Dude, the tank is just glitchy. Oh, but it wrecks these zombies. Can I run them over? Oh, this is hard to aim. Riggedy wrecked. Am I getting paid for this, though? The heck? How does the tank work? This thing feels so trash. I 
really spent Robux for this? Seems like you did, sonny. It doesn't even get me paid. This thing sucks. Bruh, do not buy the tank. It gets you glitched. I gotta reset my character. Wasn't planning on buying the tank anyways. Good, good, good. I'm happy for you. I saved you a whole bunch of time anyways. You're welcome. I have about 500 research papers that I can't wait to drop off. Yeah, I have 140. And that's the best I can do for now. Gotta sell them. Make enough money to buy that container truck. Sold. Sold. Now let's ride. I got 500 research papers. Let's see how much I can sell these tough puppies for. Driving through the forest straight to the researcher. And let's grab some of these. Sell that off. Oh, money feels good. Yeah, I bet it does. I, on the other hand, still have to get 200 sold at a time so I can afford the better vehicle. And off this depot, I made $3,400. Bro, my game is glitched. I have a box in my hand now. Whatever. I've got to go and empty all these papers here. Oh my gosh, 300 more in this box. Zombies are attacking me, Sonny. I gotta take them out. This might be the ultimate way to make money. Can I drive with this box? I think I can. Come on. Sell. Take it. Sell. Wait, what happened to my box? Oh, I think it fell on the ground. I guess you can't drive with a box in your hand. Dang it. Yeah, I need to spend some more actual Robux so I can get some dollar dollar bills real quick. Here we go. And it's time to spend like crazy. I got a better idea. I'm just gonna walk this box over there. Yeah, there's still quite a bit in here. 184 more. Treadmills, and I'm out of money. There's so many treadmills that you can get. I think I'm gonna sell all this and then reset my character as a shortcut. Just gotta get to the scientist first. Hey, buddy. I wanna give you lots and lots of research. This data will help you cure the zombie virus. Yes. I have $4,000. Reset character. Sonny, I've got you working in the basement for me. Dang it. I hope I have a melon down here soon too then. I'm gonna fill my inventory up like this. And then if I grab the cardboard box, there's gonna be a lot, a lot, a lot of papers in here. Ugh, I misclicked. Dang it! I messed up big time. It's fine. I'll walk it off. I accidentally upgraded my capacity and I wanted to buy the cargo truck. You messed up big time. It's fine. I'm gonna sell so many papers. And then, Melon, I'm gonna buy the ultimate weapons and destroy the zombies! Good for you, Sonny. I'm trying to complete my tycoon here. And in order to do that, I'm gonna need to spend even more money. I have 2.8 thousand. Reset characters faster than walking. Then I'm gonna buy the cargo truck and fill it up. What's a UV analyzer? Bro, I'm finding even better ways of making research paper. Whatever. I just purchased the cargo carrier. These things are insanely expansive. So the cargo truck can hold 500? How'd you get it to 2,000? No, I got it to 1,100. How? I don't know. Dude, it doesn't even drive. What the heck's wrong with this thing? You can't even turn it. Yeah, it's really hard to turn. Oh my god. Whatever. And I think it's time I make another depot real quick. Give me all these papers. You gotta get some momentum if you want to turn. Yeah, I realize that. Grab the box. Consume the box. Kill the zombie. Time to fill up the cargo trucker. Store. Consume. Store. Consume. Store. Store. You're right. It holds 1100 because it's doubled up. Yes. And soon, Melon, I will fill it to the brim. Are you really gonna fill up the entire truck? Are you crazy? Why not, bro? I got a lot of treadmills here working over time. Yeah, I gotta get some more treadmills. I maxed them all out, but there's so many of them. Yep. And then you can expand the walls and get even more, probably. No, those are the UV analyzers. Trust me, I already did it. Are you kidding me, Melon? Stop buying cash with Robux. I have to. It's the only way. You could play the game. No, I'm getting an automatic collection system down here as well. UV analyzer. Can't afford it. Okay, my truck will be full after this depot. Just gotta grab the papers. Grab all that research from these zombie brains. Alright, good enough. This should do the trick. Oh, I uh, whatever. It's fine. Ooh, man. The automatic collection system is actually pretty solid for the down below zombies. Whatever. I filled up my truck. It's time to do a delivery. Bro, this thing sucks. Why? I almost died to a zombie. There's literally a speedy zombie trying to get in my truck right now. No, back up. That was close. And I take and sell. Rinse, repeat. I'm about to fill up my truck completely. Did you do that yet, Sonny? Yep. 1100, bro. I'm selling them right now. Making bank. Oh, yeah, brother. I am about to be rich. I just made 8,000 off of this, and then I'll reset myself. 8,000? That's pretty solid, Sonny. And I'll respawn the vehicle. Excellent. Time to fill that puppy back up. I do want to see what happens when you remove all these baseboards, though. I'm about to sell 1,100 myself. Not bad, Melon. You're gonna make $8,000 and be rich. What if I make more? I mean, it's possible. And with this money, expand! UV analyze! Let's go! Grab the papers, and my inventory's already full. Here we go. Store this full truck. Let's go hit a depot. Speedrun style. Make 
that eight thousand dollars? You think you're so good. Oh, I know I'm so good at the video game. Collecting, collecting data. With all of this research, I will become the zombie ruler of the world. Sonny, I don't think I'm gonna make eight thousand dollars. Oh, you were broke, you then. The heck, I only made seven point three thousand. Do you have double cash? Yeah. Oh, then I don't know. I always go with a full inventory as well. Maybe that was it. The auto collector is kind of annoying. It only grabs one trip and then drops the box off until you come back. Yeah, and I think it's time to do a bit more pay to win. Melon, enough's enough. Oh, enough is never enough, Sonny. It is just never enough. More UV analyzing. That's it. I'm buying myself a cool weapon and I'm just gonna go slaughter zombies. I'm gonna win this game. I will complete my tycoon. Oh yeah, well, I got a Remington and I got an MP5. I'm gonna just blast some zombies. Oh yeah, well, I just completed all my UVers and I'm going to get an automatic collection system. How do you feel about that? I actually don't care. Yeah, I know you're jealous. Getting all that walk speed. And let's get some cool armor and stuff. Oh, I'm dead broke. There are so many giants out here. I gotta fight them. I gotta get paid. Ooh, get clapped. Oh yeah, big reload, big reload. All right, take them down, take them down. I'm running a good business here. I've got maximum profits. Oh yeah, well, I'm spraying praying. I'm making bank off these zombies. You could keep your research, you nerd. I'll make money through combat. You do that, Sonny. I'm gonna max out my armory as well for fun. Remington, double barrel, light vest, heavy vest. Ooh, I could even get a military grade vest. Here we go. Time to make the delivery finally. Yeah, I just need a little bit more cash and I can max out my tycoon. No way, bro. Yeah, all I gotta do is max out the armory and upstairs and I'm done. Not bad, Melon. That's actually awesome. I wish I could give you my cash. I wanna see what it looks like when you max it out. Well, you can just come to my tycoon. I'm gonna max it out pretty soon here. Okay, I'm also making bank right now. I'm heading to your house, Melon. And on the way there, I'm gonna take out some zombies. Let's go. Got him. Let's see this house. Barbed wire and barriers out front. That's awesome. Oh, you didn't do that? No, of course I didn't do that, bro. Yo, and I can't even go in your base. You got me killed. How did I get you killed? The laser fence. Oh, my bad, broski. I forgot about that. Hold on, I'm gonna reset my character and come there and let you in. Whatever, I don't even wanna go in. I'm buying UV analyzers and stuff. Wasting all my hard-earned cash. Good for you, Sonny. I am going to max out the outside because I wanna see what it looks like. Barbed wire, barriers, barbed wire. All right, maxed out outside, looking pretty snazzy. And now let's uh, get some decor. Plants, TV. All right, maxed out first floor. Let's go. Now all I gotta do is max out my armory. And I'm done. Aug, military grade vest. And all I need is this SKS. Oh wait, nope, there's more guns. Bro, there's no way you're almost done. Bro, I just need to think two more guns and I'm done. So one more depot and I'm chillin'. I bet you paid to win 10 more times, didn't you? I'm gonna be honest, Sonny. I probably spent about 10,000 Robux. Are you kidding me, bro? Why? I had to, Sonny. It was taking too long. You don't have to do that, Melon. You could have been more honest and vigilant. Nah, Sonny. It's taking way too long and I wanted to complete this tycoon. I guess that's fair enough. Are the UV analyzers the last upgrades in the basement? Yes, they are. Okay, so I'm not that far behind you. Yeah, but they're, they're freaking expensive. They're by far the most expensive upgrade. Yeah, but I also have almost another full cargo truck, which will be 8,000 buckarooskis. So I'm about to get rich. Alrighty. What the heck? I completed my cargo truck, but then it just glitched beneath the map. No! Did you just lose 1,100 research papers? Please tell me it's still there. Okay, all of it's still there. That would have sucked. Same thing happened to me! What is this? Sunny, good news. You'll be okay. You'll still have your research papers. That was insane. I'm gonna sell all of this off and finally complete this tycoon. Yeah, well, I'm driving my truck too. I hope I have the research paper still. That'll suck otherwise. Yo, I'm getting pinned down by a giant. Bro, go away. Yeah, you have to kill him. When oh, I lost my 2x cash, that is really unfortunate. Yeah, you probably should have rebought that. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, drive the cargo truck, dodge the zombies, turn left, get to the research station. Dude, there's a speedy zombie stuck in my wheels. Really? I just had to do that. All right, how many guns do I have left? 1600 here. Boom. And bro, I'm like four five hundred dollars off. Are you kidding me? You know what to do, Melon. Just buy it. Yes, of course. For the small price of 280 Robux. And I just got myself some extra guacamole before I sell off all my papers. The final weapon! The AA-12! I've done it! Also, Melon, you lied to me. My truck is empty! It doesn't have full papers! Really? I had full papers when it happened to me. Oh my gosh, I just wasted so much time and I'm not gonna get enough money to upgrade my place now. Now let's see how strong 
this weapon is. Bro, it's weaker than the normal pistol. What is this? Okay, maybe it's a little bit stronger. Yo, Melon, nice vest, bro. You look so stupid. I look awesome, Sonny. Now check out my top security base. Okay, Melon, credit where it's due. The barriers and the barbed wire looks awesome out front. Yeah, you can see I've even got myself a TV, some plants and everything. Yeah, I don't really know why you wanted to remove all the boards from the windows, though. That feels a little counterproductive. Now, Sonny, I've disabled my lasers, but now you're trapped in here. Whatever, it's fine. Let me check this place out. Yo. Your armory is stacked. You should wear the golden one, though. It's better. Nah, bro. I want my military equipment. Nice. Let's see what's going on downstairs. And then downstairs, I have everything. Holy smokes. I was so close to completing the tycoon as well, but then I just got scammed for all my research. Well, Sonny, sounds like a you problem. Whatever, bro. There's one thing that can make me feel better, and that's if all the goats press the like button, and anyone who's new around here should press subscribe to get goaded. Today in Roblox, we're trying to survive versus giant enemies. These enemies can take the form of legendary Roblox players like the Bacon Hair Noob or Preston, the developer of Pet Simulator. And and the giants can even be your friends. Look out, it's a giant melon! This one's up to you, Sonny. We'll need to unlock every weapon in the game to survive against these bosses. Let us know in the comments which is your favorite weapon. And subscribe in the next two seconds to get goaded. One, two, let's go! Oh no, Sonny. There's a giant ghost giant, and we need to take him out. What do you mean there's a ghost giant? I don't see anything. That's exactly what I'm talking about. He's a ghost. And there's a storm. What the heck is going on? Oh, wait, I see the ghost. He's back here, Melon. I'm shooting him in the cheeks. Hold on, I want to shoot him in the cheeks too. Die! Yeah. Oh no, he sees me. The ghost is on to me. Bro, he's so creepy. His face looks like a zombie. Bro, he's in the barn right now. He's ripping it to shreds. Yeah, but he's trapped and I'm hitting a wombo combo on him. I almost have $400. Oh, I have $1,000. Bro, how are you so rich? Because I'm a goat. Oh, look at this giant. What are you gonna do? Ow, he killed me. Did you get stomped in one hit? Yeah, I don't know why I was so confident he murked me, Sonny. You are not very smart, Melon. Is there a way for you to come back to life, or is this all up to me? Oh, I'm back. Oh, nice. He summoned in the lightning storm, by the way. It's the ghost who's doing that. Okay, I have 500. I can buy this slingshot. Let's go. Take him out, Sonny. He's still got a quarter of his health left. Bro, the slingshot is popping off. It attacks way faster than that. Oh, no. Oh, no! Yeah, Melon, you're gonna want this. It's way better than the crossbow. Sonny, this guy, he's moving so fast. Check this. No, I can't dodge! I'm dead. <laughs> I just watched you get splatted. Yeah, bro, this slingshot is literally a machine gun. But I'm gonna upgrade to the next tier. It's called a revolver. Uh, I'm gonna do that, too. Oh, no, Melon. Melon, I need help! He's about to crush me! He's so fast! Sonny, I'm taking him out. I got KO'd out of the map. What the? Come on. Die, I can't move for some reason. No! I'll save you, Melon! How did we win? And how does it say I survived? Yeah, I don't know. I think I saved your life because I was still respawning when I was shooting him. Bro, I died twice. But you clutched up. That's the important thing. So, Melon, is this entire game just us trying to defeat these giants? Yeah, pretty much. Wait, I can't move! Why can't I move? That was not cool. Yeah, I think our game's glitched. I think we're gonna have to leave and rejoin. For real? Yeah. No, Melon, I have a better idea. I'll get this. Nope, never mind. 5,000 Robux, forget it. What about this? That's a lot more reasonable. Melon, I'll reconnect after this. I just gots to try it. I'm back in. Please load faster! I can't move. You fool. I'm trying to hit him with a black hole gun. I've got a banana gun. And I'm wrecking him! Oh, yeah? Watch this. Holy smokes, this thing's gonna make me rich! I have 150,000 now. How do you have $150,000 already? 300,000, bro! Because I did some paying to win while you rejoined, and I bought the black hole ray gun. How the heck did I just die? What happened? Bro, he's doing meteor strikes. That's it. Banana blaster. I need whatever gun you bought. No, Melon, you need to go through all of the guns. I will buy this, a potato launcher. Oh no, I'm super dead, bro. Yep, he just crushed my soul. I think I need to relog like you did. I'm taking him out with the banana gun. 
And I'm making hecka dough. You don't know anything about big money, Melon. For that, you need the black hole launcher. I know big money. I'm buying myself the potato launcher as we speak. Oh, I got the spud right here. But Melon, I'm gonna upgrade beyond that. Let's go for the paintball gun. How much money do you have? 700,000, but I can't buy the next tier. This guy is so quick. Leave me. Oh, he got me. Melon, it's making me spend Robux because I'm not at a high enough level. You need to be level 22 for this. How do you level up? By shooting this guy. I guess that makes sense. Yay! I'm ranking up, bro. I'm level 9. Also, Sonny, be careful. If you get stomped, you get glitched. This game has not been maintained. That's okay. We got the Dubberton. And now I shall examine the gears, Melon, and I can buy the cash magnet as well as the super speed coil. Yeah, I think I'll use super speed. Bro, I am zooming. Ew, look at this monster! Melon, I'm going back to my OP weapon. I'll be right back, Sonny. Yeah, and I'm gonna be rich. I'm gonna save up millions of dollars as I kill the giant snowman. Level 10, let's go. Oh no, he summoned the meteors. But it don't matter, because I'm officially a millionaire. Let's go. Sonny, what did you buy? The black hole gun. I'm gonna get the crazy futuristic minigun, though. You sure about that? Don't you see the price on it? 5,000? I've gotta get it, Sonny! Melon, don't be an idiot! You said this game's not even maintained! I got it, Sonny. It's too late. Oh my gosh, you really spent 5,000 Robux on that garbage. Yes, I've got it. Equip it. Yeah! Melon, let's see what it does. Unleash the beast! Die! Oh my goodness, I made $48,000. Die! Bro, you're obliterating this boss. You're gonna be rich. Oh, I'm dead. Sonny, I already have $2 million. And climbing! All right, you got more money than me. You win. Let's go! $5.5 million unlocked. That is broken. You just cheated the whole game. Uh, I don't know about that. Now I'm gonna unlock every single weapon. Wait, what the heck? Why am I stuck here? Because you cheated. Oh no, Sonny. I'm using this mini firework launcher, and he's gonna catch up to me! Well, Melon, I'm using the firework launcher as well. I'm dead, Sonny. He got me. No surprises there. You couldn't handle the heat from Preston, bro. This is the guy who made Pet Simulator. Which means I shouldn't hold back. Gotta use the black hole gun. Yep, let's obliterate. Hey, Melon, you want to pop out the minigun and blast them? I do, Sonny. And I've got myself an infinity coil, which actually isn't even doing anything. Very confused. Yeah, I bought the super speed coil. I don't think it works either. Dang it! This game's a scam. You're the one who spent 5,000 Robux on it like an idiot. Sonny was totally worth it. Now I'll destroy him! Let's go! And I'll blind you. No, Sonny, stop blinding me. I've got to take down Preston. Yeah, bring down the big gamer. Bring him down quick, bro. He's about to stomp me. No, I got stuck on a tree. I guess I am moving a bit faster with this infinity coil. No way. I'm actually alive. Oh, I'm dead. And Preston's dead. Melon, the question is, can we unlock every weapon in the game versus this bacon hair? I'm trying, Sonny. But I got to keep leveling up. Give me my futuristic weapon. And go in. Sonny, I'm level 17. Well done, Melon. I'm just skipping all the tiers. I'm about to unlock a plunger. I've done it. The plunger is all mine. Holy smokes, this thing is rapid fire. I'm sending this bacon hair back down to the sewer realm. He's going to become a skibbity toilet. Ah, bacon hair. Oh, yeah, bro. He is getting wrecked. This is crazy. Dead. That was too easy peasy, Sonny. Yep, and now I'm going to upgrade a little farther. Tier 2 weapons, 129 Robux? Sure, buddy. Let's see just exactly what we're cooking with. Bro, this attack speed is insane. Sonny, this guy is scary. He's an evil snowman with a teapot. Don't worry, Melon. You can take him on 1v1 while I pay to win. Okay, you have fun with that, Sonny. I wonder how much this will pay me. It shoots super slow. If only I could catch up to this big guy. Sonny, I'm about to take him out. Bro, this thing is trash. I'll let you take him out, though, Sonny. 
Oh, thank you. I killed the teapot. Thank you very much, because he was about to take me out. Don't worry, Melon. Soon I'll have a lava pistol. This thing better be good. Melon, it's decent, but you're way stronger. These 5,000 Robux were well spent. I gotta run for my life and keep upgrading. I need the scar. From Fortnite? Yeah, actually, though. I got it. Oh, it's actually putting in some work. I'm doing good DPS. Oh, this bacon hair is dead. Boom! Melon, soon I'll have a ray gun. How strong is the ray gun, Sonny? Let's see. Are any of these free-to-play weapons going to be stronger than your gun? I doubt it. What level are you right now, Sonny? Only 16, but I only have two guns left to unlock. How? I can't unlock any of these. I'm just paying to win. And oh no! Melon, it's you! Are you serious? I can't take down a fellow watermelon. This one's up to you, Sonny. Bro, I gotta upgrade my weapon. I need the space rifle at least. Sonny, how did you even do this pay to win? You just literally click the pay Robux get now button. Okay, bring him down! Okay, this thing does a lot of damage, but I need more. I need much more power. I'm going all the way, Melon. The final pay to win for the biochemical blaster. What is it, Sonny? What is it? We have now unlocked every weapon in the game. I am using this thing, and I will turn you into ectoplasmic melon goo. No! Oh, yeah, buddy. Get cooked. You're getting smelted. How much money do you make off that? Uh, I don't want to tell you. You might be embarrassed. How much? One million per hit. What? Actually? No, I'm lying. It's only 350. It's pretty trash. Oh, wait. Actually, dude, I get like 50k per hit. I know, you're making way more than me. But I am still melting you down slowly. Wait, I was shooting myself. Ow, that actually really hurt. Melon, think about it. There's only room for one of you in this world. Who's it gonna be, the fake giant clone or you? You're right, die! Destroy this wonder, Melon! Take him out, Sonny. Woo! We got it now. We got it, the giant's dead! We did it, Sonny. We defeated myself. And you goats should defeat that like button. Press it right now to get goaded. Today I'm gonna 100% complete Cart Ride Tycoon. The goal of this tycoon is simple, to build your very own cart ride. But that's the easy part. Afterwards, you have to complete your cart ride. Stick around to see what rewards lie at the very end. It's time to create my Cart Ride Tycoon. And the first things first, I need a coconut tree for, uh, Whatever reason, I guess. Where's all my money, by the way? Hey, I just made 25 bucks. Oh, I get it. This tree is dropping coconuts, which makes me money. I need to collect more and more. And I might as well just get 2x cash. You know, why not? Why not? But it's still giving me plus 25. Where is it? Oh, it's right here. Now I should be getting plus 50. Let's get another coconut tree right about here. Oh, I gotta collect my money. My bad. There we go. And now, I have added myself... Wait, two upgraders? Now I'm making a hundred bucks. I get it now, I get it. I just wish I could see my total money somewhere. What's this, a cave for 15,000? Dude, I don't have 15,000. How am I supposed to unlock a cave? So stupid, this game is actually dumb, man. But I vow to complete this tycoon. And the only way to do that is by making maximum cash. Why does this guy's tycoon look so sick? It's like a sandcastle. Hold on, I need to explore a little bit. What if I head over here? It looks like there's a cart that I could access. Treasure this way. Can use custom hearts. All right, let's go then. I want some treasure. It's time to zoom. What's in here? Yo, where the heck am I? Oh my goodness! Okay, I gotta be careful. Stop. Oh no. Oh no. How did I survive those boulders? Oh my goodness. I can't believe it! I somehow survived! Shoot the targets to get rid of obstacles. Um, with what? With what? Where's the target? I don't even see it. Man, I'm so confused right now. When am I supposed to shoot? And how do I shoot? Oh, I get it now. Here we go. Shoot that target. I don't know what that just did, but I'm knocking over another bridge. And it's time. No. Nope. Oh no. No! Hold on, I gotta get to this other ice man right there. Come on. Avoid the boulders. Jump on the other snowman. Let's go! I'm really confused on what I'm doing right now. 
And like, what's my prize for doing this? Will I get to build an awesome tycoon? Oh wait, I think I know what I'm supposed to do here. I can't ditch my snowman just yet. Gotta jump on him here. Dude, aim. Aim low. What is happening? Shoot the blue target! I'm about to hit the red one. Can I please shoot the blue target? What is this? Two hours later. There we go. I think my prize is right there. Shoot the red target. I gotta shoot all of these targets. And the pink one. There we go. I've cleared it all. I don't know what I got. I got a Christmas secret award. I'll take it. Don't really know what it did. But hopefully it helped my tycoon a little bit. Blow up the towers with tanks. Mission failed. We'll get them next time. What the heck just happened? I'm so confused. I'm just gonna continue to add to my tycoon. Might as well get myself a gold money tree. Just buy everything here. Cause I need more money. I must complete this tycoon. Hey, check it out. Gold and coconut. And that diamond coconut looks insane. Yo, it's giving me 5,000 a coconut. Bro, I'm literally rich now. I got 30k. I'll get this. Might as well get myself a speed coil so I can move around a little bit quicker. And now I've got some nice ambiance. Do you hear that sound? It's beautiful. I think it's time to buy a bunch of stuff. Like a cart. We're in a cart ride obby after all. First track. Oh my goodness, I'm getting to build my very own track. I wonder what treasures I shall find. I've even got myself a cave. Okay, okay, now this obby's getting real interesting. What's even in here? I don't know, I think it's just decor. And now we've maxed out my palm tree farm. There we go, we got some security systems set up all around my tycoon. This place is cleaning up nice. Let's make some plants, some jungle trees. And now I think we've got everything here. It's just time to assemble the track. Oh, and I even have a choice of carts. And that's what I found earlier, the Santa's sleigh. I can use it, let's freaking go. And I love Christmas. And uh, we're, we're not on the track anymore, okay. So yeah, we still have a lot of building to do. But dude, this track looks awesome. We got a dark arcade looking room to start. We got a, some creepy animatronics like this panda, this bear, whatever the heck this is. We gotta get out of here actually, we just need more tracks. And a stone fist. What does this lever do? Ooh, I get to change directions on my track. I could explore this way or continue to explore down here. I think it's time I continue to explore down here. Down the main thing. Dude, this is honestly really awesome, Lokis. Whoa! Secret waterfall room! I didn't even notice. Well, I did notice. So, props to me on that. I'm gonna go back and upgrade my money a little bit. Or at least collect my money. So I can continue to invest and make the most awesome tycoon track ever. Is that a million? No, it's 105,000. Let's continue down this track. We've got to complete this tycoon. Spam everything. Then we'll take a look at it after. Hey, we have a new starting place. And we have a spot to peek out. Golden Minecraft statue. Whoa! That thing looks tough. And whoa, we got a lot of... St Why can't I jump in that? What the heck? Dude, I just got baited so hard. This guy is zooming down my tycoon. Need to purchase more. All of the tracks. Oh, I died. Let's spawn in my cart and go down. Let's explore a little bit. Whee! What the? Where did those noobs come from? Dude, this is crazy. I actually low-key love this tycoon. I just gotta stop here. And it's time for me to purchase more. Don't you dare knock me off, cart. That thing was going crazy. But now, I've purchased myself a mega cart! Yo, I gotta try this thing out. Let's get in this bad boy and let's zoom. All right, I'm going fast. Hey, I'm hitting the end right here. That was a pretty fun mega track. How do I get out of this cart? Oh, there's a little step for me right here. Step on this. Boom, I've got myself heaven. Dude, this obby's crazy. I'm completing heaven now. I've even got myself a rage table. <laughs> what is this game? I just sent myself a table flying. Shrink potion. Micro cart. Yo, we had the big cart. 
Now we've got the mini cart. I'm hopping out. Bro, I'm way too big for this cart. How am I supposed to drive it? With the shrink potion. That's how I'll drive it. Spawn this bad boy in. And then I'll hop on in. Still feel a little big for this cart, but it's fine. I'm going through the mini town. Yo! Oh, this kind of was awesome until my cart flipped. Let me in. Let me in! No, dang it! Whatever. I'm gonna continue to explore this place, but just on foot. I'm not gonna lie, that mini cart was pretty cool, but also pretty terrible. It's time for me to continue to add... A grow potion? And a stairway to what? Another stairway to heaven? Yo, what the heck is that sound effect, bro? I just grew a little bit. Now I got a lot of stairs to go. This is such a crazy tycoon. Oh, you need the gravity coil to get up the stairs, I see. Anyways, as I was saying, this tycoon is so ridiculous. After I finish it, I've got to go through it once again and see what it's like from start to finish on a cart. Gem Island Teleporter? Bro, how many things are there? Whoa, what is this? Dude, I think each door unlocks a brand new tool. I can build walls now! What about this one? How come I can't go on this one? What the heck, bro? Can I go back? Okay, thank goodness it can send me back. And dude, there's even more. There's a new island over here. But I need to head back to spawn. I don't have enough money. But I have been building up millions, most likely. Let's see. If I collect this, I got 3 million cash just sitting there for me. And now I'm gonna go on my card ride. Oh no, I lost my cart. Time to zoom a little bit here. Down the track, let's go! You can see all of the glorious- Dude, I did not build this way. I completely forgot about this. What the heck can I do here? Yo, you can cut down the tree? Yo, I think you have to push the tree across to parkour. That's crazy. Looks like I'm going the rest of the way on foot, at least until the teleporter. Spawn in that giant cart. It's the only way. Let's make it to the end, baby. There we go, doot and do. Dude, there's even more. There's also a sky track. This is crazy. Yo, what the heck? I just pushed. Oh, wait, no, I'm going straight up. Yo, what? I gotta go back down because I don't have a cart, but that's awesome. All right, I gotta head back to my teleporter because I'm almost done here. I think I've just gotta head over to the sky island and start buying these upgrades. Boom. Good money gem. 100 million? How am I supposed to afford that? How much money does money cost? Dude, I literally can't afford that. 100 million is too crazy. I guess we'll never know what's behind this door. But what I do know is that subscribe button's just below the video. You should totally press it now. Anyways, I'm gonna finish up the rest of what I can. Here we are. And I think all I have left to do is to finish up this way. Boom. Push the tree the right direction. Do it again. There we go. Yo, it's actually low-key crazy. Do it across here. Grapple hook. Oh, that was it. I've done it! I've completed my obby! And now for one last victory lap. From start to finish. Let's go quick. Da Dude, these guys need to move. They need to move. That's it, rage tabling them. Yo, that actually kind of worked. Just gotta rage table again, more accurately. Let's go! I got the carts out of the way with my rage table. Now it's time for my victory lap. Let's move to the groove. Here we are. We'll continue down the normal cart path because I want to take the sky rail. So go here, continue bringing it down. Let's go, dude, this is awesome! Right down here, skis. Keep on going. And time for the sky rail. I'm going all the way up. Oh, I almost went backwards. So it's here, to here. Hey, now I've made it to this secret island. Just, um, I, I don't know the secret password. Goats, if you know the secret password, comment down below right now. Anyways, that is my cart ride, and my tycoon has been completed. Goats, if you like this video, make sure you subscribe right now.
Hold on. Maybe I can open all of these places. Let's try. Boom. Rocket jumper. Zombie stuff. Let's see what this does. Probably summon zombies. Yep, I summon zombies. And they're hitting me? Oh no. Rocket jumper. No! This is a big mistake. I messed up. I summon zombies. Goats, subscribe quickly! We're gonna go from noob to pro in Age of Tanks. We'll start out as caveman tanks, but eventually we'll upgrade to modern tanks and even futuristic tanks. So make sure you comment down below if you like this video and we'll do more. Welcome to Age of Tanks. Melon, this one's a little bit different. We're gonna see if we can battle through the ages and become the most powerful tanks in the world. Oh my goodness, Johnny. What will the first generation of tank be? It's a caveman oh, tank. Yeah. Look at this. Get in there, boy. But you guys are just gonna tie each other, no? Actually, we're gonna die, bro. We are literally way too weak. But we're gonna unlock some coins. No way. Why do they have so many cavemen tanks? I don't know, bro. They have a freaking army. We only have 50 health. The enemy has 300. It's not fair. Oh, yeah, we're getting smoked. We're getting smoked. Yeah. Plus, they just evolved. They have spears. Sonny, you need your coins now. I know. I'm trying to save up some shmoney, but we're getting annihilated. This is not good. Do something. Thing, and we're dead. It's okay. It was the very first battle we were meant to lose, but we got 56 coins, which means we can now upgrade our units. Check it out, bro. And then we're gonna upgrade these tanks through the ages from a Stone Age caveman to a farmer. Let's go. What do you think we should do? We have 56 coins. Should we do some upgrades right away or save up for the farmer? I think we do some upgrades, Sonny. This way we can make more money quicker. Okay. So, let's see the evolution tree. Oh my goodness, 2,000. We're not doing that. So, let's get this and data and data. Oh, yeah, we're getting that one, too. Well, that's all we can do. <laughs> we just bought a bunch of speed upgrades. At least we make some more meat now. It's all about the shmeat. But I don't know if this is going to be enough. Oh, we're definitely not going to beat them. But we'll make some more shmoney this round. Actually, Melon... We might power through. We have more tanks than them. And once our army amasses, we're going to be super strong. Oh, wait, they have two. No, they have three. Oh, my goodness. Maybe that's the strat. You have to save up a bunch and send them all in one go. Wait for it. That's three. Unleash the horde! No way. Wreck them! Oh, no, that spear guy is pretty strong. It's okay. We brought a backup guy in. We got to build the army again. They have a lumberjack, Sonny. That guy is no joke. He's crazy, bro. He's a ferocious saber-toothed caveman. And we're going to be dead. Yeah. Can we kill him at least? No, that's, that's it for us. Oh, yeah. We got smoked. But now we have 84 coins. Coins. I think we just have to keep battling a little longer here, Melon, and save up 150 coins. I think you're right, Sonny. Let's do this thing. Except this time, Melon, I'm not gonna spawn a single tank until this dude reaches our cave. That's four. Five at once! Let's go. Take these bad boys out! Reinforcements! Two more! Oh yeah, we're popping off now. Dude, do you think we'll reach their base? We're going in. We're gonna try. <laughs> Oh, let's go! And I'll get five more again. Oh my goodness, they just sent out five. Well, you might as well send your boys out. We got six this time. We could take out the saber tooth guy. Maybe? Bro, that guy is so OP! Can we kill him? I want the coins! At least kill that guy, please! Oh, come on. We're dead, brother. We're dead. We tried, Sonny. But check it out. This time we're rich. But I will do this, Melon. 150 coins invested! Let's go. We've got the cave hunter now. And we've purchased more- Okay, that was a waste of money. That was pointless. Well, Sonny, you might as well start again. Yep, that's true. And this time, Melon, I'm gonna watch an ad. Melon, this time I saved up a bunch of shmeat so I could do this. We got one spear thrower in the back. There we go, Sonny. Maybe this will actually work this time. Yeah, we got two of them. We need another tank in the front to hold it down. You need another tank right now, Sonny? No, no, no. I need to save up. I need to save up. Oh, yeah, we're popping off. We can take out the caveman finally. Oh, we got him. We actually got him! Wait, can you actually win this, Sonny? Oh, definitely not. Oh, though, it keeps going. Okay, it doesn't end. Yeah, you have to destroy their cave, which is gonna be impossible. But we took out one of the Sabertooth cave guys. Look how much coins we made this round. 140. That's pretty good, Sonny. Let's go. Melon, we're getting stronger. Look at how fast we're producing foods now. And Sonny, I got a strategy here. Let them hit your base a little bit before you spam all your troops down. Okay, how low should I let the health drop? 
think to like 20. Okay. We'll let it deplete. Let it drain. Look at our food, broski. I can get five spears. All right, you should probably... Yep. Yeah. Oh, no. Please. Please kill that guy. Oh, no. Yes! We're killing them! Let's go. We've got an army now! We need more tanks in the front. We gotta stop that guy with the battle axe! Bro, we might actually hit their base here. There's a chance we hit the base. Sending out three more normal tanks. We gotta protect the spears. This is huge, Sonny. This is huge! Roll out, boys! Oh, what the heck? He one-shots them? Yeah, that guy does a lot of damage. But so do we. We're getting rich off of this round! All right. We won't hit their base, but we'll at least do some damage here, Sonny. Oh. Oh, we're gonna get wrecked by these three. There's four. Oh my god, you're right. There's five. <laughs> okay, well, we accept our fate. But we'll battle them! Let's go. Can we take one out? Get that extra cash? Dude, our guys are trash. They didn't even target the right thing. But Melon, we're getting rewards. We've unlocked bonuses. Yo, we're gonna pop off. Oh, we need gems for that, though. Melon, we have 300 coins. Do we save up for the big boy or do we increase our food production? Mm, I'm thinking we save up for the big boy, Sonny. Let's do it. And I say we run that same strategy again. I'm for it. It made us a lot of guacamole. And goats, we're new to this game. So if you know any good strategies, comment them down below and we'll try them out in the next video. We need more spears. They do so much damage. The tanks are just distractions in the front. Hold it down. Hold it down. Bro, they're one-shotting things now. Two more spears. Oh, he needs some tanks in the front. These guys are gonna hurt! Oh my goodness, they have so many tanks. They had so many batters. It's okay. We've got an army too. We're approaching their cave! Oh, it's Can we hit the- Oh, never mind. We tried, Mel. We got close. That's the closest we've ever been. And we might take out another one of them. Yeah, I think I'll just do this really quick. Slow him down, spear him up. Hey, not bad. We made some decent coin that time. And now we get to unlock him ourselves, the chief. Now, let's put some more in a food production, Sonny. Yep. Who cares about base health? That's boring. But I'll do one upgrade. Oh, look at this. Our food is popping off. Yep. Soon we'll be out of this caveman world. I feel like we'll take their base out. The question is, Melon, what's the strat this time? Uh, I say we run it back the same way. But this time, use some of those big boys. What if we only do the big boys? All right, sure, I'm down. And wait for it. Unleash the horde! Let's go. Take them out, boys. Take them out. Now send some spears behind. You got it. Oh. Oh, this is clean. Hack and slash them. Bro, they're actually done for. They're done for. We're going to hit their base. Wait, they have Yo. spears. They have spears coming out of their cave. It's fine, Sonny. We're doing damage here. Dude, they just released so many units. It's fine. Everything's going to be fine. At least we got rich. We made a lot of guacamole. Sonny, spam out those big boys when you can. All right, just sent four more. Oh, no. Our boys will be dead. Backup's on the way, though. We're getting paid stacks, dude. We have over 500 now. Let's go. What else are they going to send, you think? I don't know, but their food production's got to be running low. I think we actually took him out. You think so? Yeah, Sonny. Let's go. We actually did it. Level one destroyed. That was sweet. And now, Sonny, we're in the farm world. Yeah, but to evolve is 2,000 buckarooskis. I, I don't know if we should do that. I think we should just pump upgrades here. All right, do it. Do it for the one time. So this says we'll reset your progress. Do you think that means food production too? Oh, yeah, that's probably what that means. Well, I'm just going to spam this and it's time to battle. I don't know about this one, Melon. We're going to be up against the farmers. We're still cave people. We got this, Sonny. Send out the chieftain. When the time's right, we'll strike. But it's not time yet, Melon. It's not time yet. Oh my god, look how much damage they do. Uh, you can send stuff out before we die here? Yeah, yeah, I just did. We're pushing back. Oh my goodness, Sonny. These guys are strong. <laughs> yeah, this is not gonna work. Let's go back to the first age. We need to save up 2,000 coins if we're going to evolve, which means we got to take this out two more times. Yes, the army has been deployed. They don't stand a chance. None at all. They're done for, dude. I think we might take them out right here. Bro, we're doing hecka damage here. But we're actually not getting paid as much now. It's okay. We're getting paid a lot for how quickly we're working. That's true. <laughs> they got obliterated. Now, the thing is, Melon, do we buy more of this? I don't think so. I think we save up 2,000. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to. Back in the first battle. Goats, once we have 2,000 coins, we're gonna evolve into the second age. Five hours later. Well, Melon, we've done it. We've ransacked this place and we have over 2,000 coins coins. It's time, Sonny. We need to evolve. Let's get goaded! Continue! Yes. 
after the farming age will become Spartans. And Melon, bad news. It definitely reset our progress over here, and now we're just peasants. But look, our base health has increased significantly. True, 150. Not bad. Plus, it's gonna be peasants versus... Wait, Melon, we're gonna be against the cave people again. Oh, they're gonna get wrecked, bro. Yeah, I'm gonna send out two. I'm gonna send out two. Hold up. Wait for it. Hold. And fire. Oh, they're done, skis. Oh my goodness, that's too strong. Yeah, this isn't even gonna be fair. We're literally farming them. Our pickaxes are chunking away at their health. Got a bad feeling about these caveman guys, though. It's a little bit sketchy, but I think we got it. Yeah, I'm gonna save up a lot of guacamole before I send them out. Let's get five of them. Maybe that's ambitious. Maybe we'll settle for four. Oh, yeah, it's over four of these guys. Actually, we might lose this, Sonny. That's a lot of damage they're sending out. Oh, we cleared them up there, though. Yeah, but these spears are gonna drop him to almost dead. Oh, this is bad. Yeah, we're gonna die. Yeah, we're definitely gonna die. Well, we'll see if we get a little more coins, at least. Nope. We tried, Sonny. We tried. 394 coins, but we pumped those into some serious production upgrades. Holy smokes, these guys are finished now. Yeah, now we're gonna wreck the cavemen. Just let them build up a bit, though. You're right, bro. We're making almost triple the money. Let's let it build. And then we'll use all of this food to create an army of farmers. I'll summon them when we drop to 100 health. How about that? Sounds like a plan. We're gonna get eight of them at least. <laughs> It's over! I don't think they can survive this, Sonny. I'm gonna be honest with you. It is gonna be not close. Not even a little bit. Plus, we got backup farmer tanks rolling in on them. Yep, that, that's over for that cave. 100%. That is Jover, bro. These guys are farming up the cave system. Boom, shakalaka. They got clappered. But Melon, we need 1.2 thousand for this tank. I think I'm gonna just keep upgrading food production. I think it's a good move, Sonny. Time to battle in the age of the farmers, though. I'm not afraid. Probably should be, though. Can we keep up with them, though? I feel like they're significantly stronger than us. Yeah, but it should make us more coins. After we defeated the cavemen, we got paid 450 coins, approximately. So we'll see how many we get paid for just fighting against the farmers. Dude, we already got 128 coins. That's crazy. Crazy, we make so much more here. You say 128? Try 500, bro. We're getting rich. Let's go. Oh, but that's bad, dude. That guy's got a scythe. Yeah, can we kill this guy at least one time? I want to see how much money he pays us. Come on. Oh, it's over. Hit him. One more. Dang it. Oh, one more hit. We would have got him. At least we got paid a ton. And I think I'm going to just keep putting it back into production. Yes. And now in the next round, Sonny, I say we save up. Yeah, I think two saves and we'll be able to buy the pitchfork. They summoned one and we already have enough money for two. Now three of them. Let's go. I'm going to start summoning. Let's go. How much money can we make here? Come on, do some good D, do some good D. Can we push this squad back is the question. I want to kill that scythe guy so badly. I think we'll kill the scythe guy here. Yes, he's dead. He's dead. Bro, look how much cash we made. Bro, we just made enough single-handedly to unlock the next unit. Let's go. Yeah, now we're dead, though. Yeah, we can just accept our fate. Mega dead. But, Melon, it is totally worth it because now we have a pitchfork farmer and one more food production. Let's go. We're over one per second now. Things are looking up. The question is, do I just do an army of pitchforks to see how strong they are? I think so, Sonny. I think we might as well give it a shot. And wait for it. I'll summon one of these and all pitchforks clear them clear them out. Oh, that's nice What are they capable of I'll tell you it's mass destruction? Oh, they are popping off kill this guy before he even reaches Ooh. Yes, let's go. Can they take this army out though? They're doing pretty good here. They're making us rich, bro. They're doing pretty darn good We're gonna have so much cash by the end of this hold lines. Oh This is where we die. Yeah, but maybe we take out a couple of these guys Come on. Oh, they can't hit the pitchforks if they're inside of your base. That's cool. All right, all right. We got some good cash there. 2,600. The next unit is 3,200. Do we just save up or do we pump a little into food? I think we just save up here, Sonny. But if we made 2,600, that means we only need to have about 600 left so I can do some of this. And now we should make enough to get the upgrade and even more on top. All right, you're min-maxing here, Sonny. I hope this works out. Of course it will. I'm an absolute mathematician genius. I have solved the three body problem it's because i am the sun release the kraken no way you're already releasing the kraken i have to bro we need to take advantage of our range it's very true add some more power to the squad we'll put some frontliners this is good this is good hold them back hold them back perfect timing perfect timing oh this is nice right here 
We need a couple front liners back out there. Yo, we're actually hitting the base now. No way! We're doing damage! If we can clear these scythes out, there's a chance. Oh no, there's there's no chance. At least we made bank, though. Over 3,000 coins collected. Yeah, I think this is their last units. You can take everyone out here. Bro, I don't think so. It's close, but I don't know. Wait, the scythe. No! That was so close! Bro, whatever. We'll get them in the next round when we've unlocked the scythes. Let's go. Plus one more food production. What's the next evolution? 16,000? No way. We have to reach the Spartan Age. And we'll be able to do that after we defeat these farmers. Melon, I'm activating a skipper. Look at our food supply now. Oh, well, now we're definitely gonna win. Release the horde! You didn't unleash a single scythe. It's okay, it was all calculated. Now I put one in the front because he's a tank. Okay, I actually like this. I like these moves right now. This should be enough. Yeah, I think we got him here. I think we got him here. We need another scythe. Just spam some scythes. But I need to add to the pitchfork army. We need to overwhelm them. Overwhelm them! You send a couple of cheap units in just to mess with them. Oh, it's over, bro. It is so Jover. It is Jover for the farmers. Let's go. Come on now. They've got one last push. We got to stop them. Oh, they wiped out a lot of our forces. I think this is it, Sonny. I think that's the last unit they send out. Oh, yeah, we got it. Hack and slash time. Let's go. And we've bested them. That was crazy. 4,400. Collect double? Yes, sir. 8,000. Goats, if we defeat that one more time, we're going to be able to fight the Spartans. Let's see how strong they are. Johnny, I, I think we're going to get destroyed here. Have faith, dude. This is going to be what I call light work. Okay. I'll just do three of these scythers. Oh, we killed them. We're not as weak as I thought we'd be. Yeah, but that spear guy does damage. Yeah, we're in some trouble here. Well, we made 2,000 buckarooskis, and now we're super dead. You know what? It could have been worse. Yeah. And goats, if you want to see more Age of Tanks and watch us evolve to the Spartan Age, press the like button on this video and help it get over 5,000 likes. Do it now. Today, I'm playing banned games in Roblox. How am I going to do this, you ask? Well, when a game gets banned in Roblox, it says this, content deleted. Roblox literally overwrites the title of their game to say this. But what most players don't know is you can actually look this title up and find some of these games. That's exactly what I'm gonna do and find out why these games got banned. Were they too weird? Were they too wacky? Were they too scary? We're about to find out. So apparently if I go up here and type in content deleted in experiences, I should find a list of banned games. Wait, Boxburg isn't a banned game. What is this? Wait, there it is. Our first banned game. Content deleted. Let's scroll. Let's see if we can see some more. Oh, right here. There's another one. Okay, there's actually quite a few banned games. This looks like a murder mystery knockoff. More content deleted. Yeah, okay, okay. There's a lot of banned games we can play, but I think we start from the top. The very first banned game. It's even got 11 players on. It looks like some kind of Roblox house. Where the heck am I? Find the key card. Hello, I'm Shiro. Hi, what is this? I'm very confused. I thought this game was a banned. Oh, it's just a cess game. To start the game, finish the few obvious stages, I will be waiting for you. All right, got it. So it seems like there's a few obstacle courses that I must complete. First things first, I gotta get cute. No, I'm not spending five Robux on a pink shirt. Where do I go to complete the obby? Oh my goodness, I gotta find a key card first. It's gotta be around here somewhere. Hey, I found it. I've got the card. So far, I don't really understand why this game got banned. Seems pretty normal. Just gotta clear this obby right here. Dang it! Oh, it was a 50-50 chance and I guessed wrong. But now I'm determined to beat my very first banned game. Go on the left one first, left again. Dang it! Left, left, right. Okay, we did it, we did it. And now, we've got a stairway to heck. Actually, this is a stairway to heaven. What am I saying? Let's go! We gotta make it all the way to the top. Hey, there we go, I made it. And then I just gotta cross whatever this is. Seems pretty easy. Don't really understand. Oh, that's what this level was. I didn't realize it was disappearing, but it's fine. I've completely conquered it. And wait, did I just finish the easy levels? What's going on here? Now you need to get inside my room because I want to give you something. The key card is behind that red wall. Finish all the levels 
supposed to get the key card. I gotta beat every single level. All right, I'm on it. The melon man could do this, starting with the easy level. Bro, why is it so far back here? What is this? All right, I'm touching the door. Oh, it looks like it's some kind of dropper. Let's go. Oh my goodness. Wait, did I win anyways? Ah, uh, no, I gotta go through the green part. Come on. I did it. And now I have access to the medium level. I believe they're all droppers. Wait, no, what is this? I'm super fast. My goal was to get all the way up. Oh man, this is gonna take a while. Actually, never mind. I've got super speed and super jumps. This shouldn't be too bad. All right, goats, I'm almost there. I've just got a few more. Oh wait, no, I'm not almost there. Never mind. The heck, where am I supposed to go from here? I can't make that next jump. Maybe this game is just impossible. And that's why it got banned. Why would you take me this far to make an impossible jump? This game is stupid. Well, time to move on to the next one. Okay, okay, let's see. What do we want to play here? This kind of looks interesting. Just by the thumbnail. What are they gonna do to the little kid from Ice Age? I think we got to check it out. Uh, what is going on here? Why is my game off-centered and weird? And there's creepy music. I don't like this one bit! Oh no, it's the kid from Ice Age and Boss Baby. I bet you Caillou's even here. I've gotta get it to safety. I can see why this game got banned. It's so cursed. It's also really weird. What is going on here? Why is my screen off-centered? Bro, this is just annoying. Well, at least I can game. And I think I'll check out more banned games on Roblox. All right, all right. More banned games. I saw this murder mystery one. It's got 450 players, but it's banned. I've got to check this out. There's a murder mystery fanatic. Attempted to teleport to a place that is restricted. What is this? Is this like the dev server for murder mystery? The heck? This is just murder mystery. What is going on here? I'm very confused. This seems exactly like murder mystery too. People are dying. Oh my goodness. I've got to survive. I see why this game got banned. It's just a straight up knock. Off. And there goes our sheriff. We are gonna die. I'm gonna try Jukura. Oh, nope, I got guided. Well, I guess that makes sense. This game definitely should be banned. It's just a straight up copy. On to the next. Right, I wanna try and find a weird looking game here. Feet in the thumbnail. Maybe that's a little bit too weird. Let me try and find something else. What the heck is going on here? Okay, I think I found one that we have to play. What is going on here? Who is this dude? He's looking kind of goofy though. So I'm gonna play your banned game. Just in a house with a cozy fire. Fire, a chest, a lantern. You're playing your very first Roblox creation. Look around and try to find all seven hidden items. Is this just the basic Roblox map? Yeah, it seems like this is just the basic Roblox dev map. Well, this is kind of lame. I was hoping for something goofy, something wacky. But this, this is just boring. I think it's time we check out that feet game. All right, here it is, the feet game. The weirdest band game I could find. What is gonna be on this game? Bro, this is the exact same game as last time. It's just the the basic Roblox map. <sighs> Dude, I thought it was gonna be something weird, but it turns out it's just plain normal. Let's take a look-see for one final banned game. Yo, <laughs> what is this? Five Nights and Freddy's and GTA? I've gotta see this. It also says GTA 6. Maybe it got banned because it leaks things from GTA 6. Or maybe this is GTA 6. Um, well, either way, this mask definitely does not fit on my face. It's more like it attaches to the back of my head. Yeah, the devs really gotta fix that. Anyways, I gotta check out this new GTA 6. Six Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria. I can't believe they leaked stuff from GTA 6. This is crazy. Um, what is that sound? Oh my goodness! What is that? Okay, Foxy just got me very fast. What happens if I equip my mask? Hey, look, I'm invincible with my- Nope, I just had spawn protection. I don't think the spare mask does anything. My goal is to make it as far as I can into this pizzeria. Just gotta keep them stuck on the wall. Oh no. Oh my goodness, how are you supposed to get in here? It's pretty much just a death sentence. Well, I might as well check out the Ferris wheel then. Maybe Maybe it even works. All aboard the Ferris wheel. Let's freaking go. Okay, wait, the Ferris wheel, it actually works. Once you start sitting down, you start going, let's go. I had absolutely no faith that this thing would work, but I am happily surprised right now. I'm just gonna stop at the very tippity top. Boom. Oh, nope, it keeps going. And you go should keep going to that like button. Press it over and over and over again. And subscribe if you haven't. Today, Sunny and I are trapped and the only way out is to flush ourselves down toilets. But what? One wrong flush will lead us to our deaths. Wish us luck in the comments below. Melon, we've grown up to become big, tall men. And what do big, tall men do? Can't crawl under small things. I 
guess so, but that's not at all what I was referring to. Oh, I don't know. What do big people do? We pick toilets! Let's go! Welcome to Roblox Pick a Toilet. Yes, that's what we're doing, Melon. Well, Sonny, because I'm big, tall, and strong, obviously, the best toilet paper style is over. Yep, I'm flushing myself down this toilet. Absolutely. And the reason for that is because it can't get stuck on the wall, so it's easier to pull out. Let's go! Now, where do we go? Oh, down here. Where are we flushing ourselves to next. The most beautiful insect is the ladybug or the butterfly. Ladybugs are gross and they creep me out. What? They're good luck, bro. But butterflies are prettier. And as I was saying, Sonny, I'm always right. And let me show you the next choice. Let's see. Gotta go this way real quick. Yeah, go into the slide, climb up the slide for some weird reason. And then which would you rather have? A garden that grows donuts or a chicken that lays chocolate eggs? Bro, I'm going donuts every day of the week. Yo, nice flush, brother. I'm going in with you. Who wants a chocolate egg, dude? That's so boring. And a chicken still has to poop it. At least our garden is growing growing them naturally. And what if you confuse a chocolate egg for the chicken's poop? Gross. I guess chickens poop white anyway, so it'd be pretty hard to confuse. Okay, just stop talking about chicken poop. The best routine in the world is being an early bird or a night owl. But then again, I guess white chocolate, you might get that confused. Shut up! I want to be an early bird so I'm productive and healthy. The better routine is definitely being an early bird, but I'm gonna be a night <laughs> owl just for fun. Please tell me I'm alive. Melon! Night owl was correct! No way. I actually survived! No, I'm getting toppled like a bowling pin! Stop! I'm dead. We should have known all these Robloxers want to stay up late. They want to, but goats, I'm telling you, it's not worth it. it ruins your next day. It's much healthier to become an early bird. Because you know what they say, the early bird gets the worm. That's true. Now, Sonny, once you get over here, you gotta answer me a question. Yeah, what's that there question, Buckarooski? What do you think's the worst way to spend a full day? With your palms covered in Cheeto dust, or spinach stuck in your front teeth? This would be the worst possible thing. Imagine you can't touch anything. Your hands are disgusting. Yeah, I would not want to do that either. How was the vote that close? Bro, I feel like people were voting what they would rather have and not what the question was asking. Yeah, true. So yeah, what would you do with the time machine? Go to the past or the future? With the time machine, I would go to the past, Sonny, and see the dinosaurs and see all of history and see how mankind came to be in the true history of the world. Why do you care about mankind? Don't you want to see how the melons came to be? Oh yeah, that's actually a really good point. Uh-oh, Sonny. I think I picked the wrong one. Oh, no! Homer! Chill! He's throwing donuts at me! I'm dead. Yeah, Melon, I just saw two players flush themselves into the future, so I'm not surprised. Why would you want to go to the future, bro? At least in the past, we know what we can expect, and you could have a great adventure. But in the future, what if you arrive and it's an apocalyptic wasteland? I don't think the future is the right choice here. Whatever. Let's just slide down and get to the next voting. Melon, you gotta jump down here. Oh, why, of course. Have aliens visited our planet? Yep, I'm 100% sure they have. Yeah, I'm with you there, brother. Oh, no. No! Are you serious? You don't gotta throw toilet paper at me and fart on me and poop on me. Speaking of poo, a giant turd just crapped on me. I'm a piece of toilet paper. And I'm a piece of poo. Because I stay wiping you. Okay, just stop trying to make some poetic out of this. It's bad news all around. No, I was trying to say that I'm always wiping. but you know what, whatever. The aliens haven't visited us, okay? Yeah, hopefully this toilet cleans me off. I don't want to be a giant swirly anymore. Dang it, I'm still a poop. Now let's see, which of these takes us to our destination? Oh, this little spot right here. Would you rather live in a giant pumpkin or a giant shoe? Giant shoe, I would never live in a pumpkin. Never, ever, ever. Yeah, that shoe also looks really cool. But what if it's stinky and used? Yeah, well, at least it wouldn't be on the inside of a pumpkin and it would smell all gross and be like sweaty and then start rotting and decomposing. You're right. And I saw about five players flush themselves into the shoe. So I think that was the right vote. Excellent work, Melon. Now let's go deeper. I'm going this way, Sonny. Well, you are correct to go that way, actually. Mm-hmm, yes, I know. You find a spider in a beautifully woven web. What do you do? Knock it down or let it be? I think you stay away from it, bro. It's a spider. You don't want to mess with them. 100%. Also, it's just gross for you. Why, why are you knocking that thing down? It's going to get stuck on you. Maybe the spider crawls on you. Yeah, that's just bad news for everybody. I'm going to take the red slide. Same here, because red is the best. And I don't think it leads anywhere, Melon. I think it does, actually. You're right. What is the better dessert? Cake or ice cream? Ice cream. What if it was ice cream cake? That's the best.
best one. Cake sucks, man. I know, some cakes are really good. Did we do it? Did we beat the game? I don't know, I just flushed myself down the cake. This guy's trying to tell us something. Sorry, Melon, I don't have time for that! I'm about to die! You idiot. It's a sewer alligator. No, 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 you don't have to eat me. He ate me. Sonny, I have no choice but to just flush myself down this toilet. I've got to go to the next dimension. No way. What's over there? Uh, another bathroom. Hold on, I'm taking some ice cream. I'll be right there. This is really confusing, bro. I just jumped through a mirror. I'm about to jump through another one. But now, there's three toilets. You've got to be kidding me, Melon. It's getting more difficult in choice. The best way to wake up in the morning. Pillow fight, big yawn, or a cup of coffee. I'm going pillow fight. Wait for me. Uh-oh. Yeah, you messed up. I'm gonna go big yawn. There's a clown, and he's setting me up. He's setting me up high. I'm dead. And I voted big yawn. Am I dead? I'm alive! Bro, a pillow fight sounds fun. How are you gonna have a pillow fight if there's nobody there when you wake up? That's a good point. I'll just pillow fight myself. Melon, I got the next questionnaire. If you could only eat one food for the rest of your life, what would it be? Honestly, if you say anything other than a taco, you're crazy and you're gonna die by the age of 10. It's clearly gonna be pizza. I know, that's the most annoying part. So I'm flushing myself down the pizza. Let's go. Coolest animal structure. Beehive anthill or spider web. I feel like a beehive's pretty cool, to be honest. I'm going beehive. Are you kidding me? That's a freaking alligator. Stay away from me. Stay away! Why do I feel like you're lying to me? Uh, because I am. Oh, wait. You're dead. I see you. You're actually dead. The answer's an anthill. I guess anthills are pretty cool. Melon? Melon? I think it's spiderweb. Uh, it's gotta be anthill. Those guys flushed themselves down anthill before and died. Oh my goodness, you're right. Not again! Why is it spiderweb? Bro, oh, that's the lamest one. And now I'm getting killed by a tractor. Well, I survived. And this vote wasn't even close. Bro, an anthill and a beehive's way cooler than a spider web. I agree. What's the best way to eat pizza? Folded like a taco. Easy peasy. No one folds it up like a burrito. That's crazy. I have done that before. It was very satisfying. It's the taco styled 100%. I know. I know that's the right answer. But sometimes I want to roll up my pizza. That's weird, Sonny. That is strange. Now I'm swimming in sewer water. This is even stranger and way grosser. Ew, I'm in this as well. They didn't even give me goggles a snorkel. Which would you rather battle, Sonny? A frog, a squirrel, or a lobster? You're not riding the kid riding the frog, bro. You're, you're just, you are the kid. Oh, ride into battle. Oh. Yeah, you are cooked. But out of these three choices, I feel like the frog is gonna be the winner. You know why? Because it can go in both land and water. I was gonna say because of Naruto. I'm going with Frogger. Yeah. I'm gonna go with the armored lobster. Oh my goodness. Are you kidding me? Why? It wasn't the frog? Nope, and now I'm getting farted on by an orangutan. No way! I'm getting killed as well! Bro, why are you riding a squirrel? I'm getting rubber ducked. I'm getting squeaked. I got squeaked. Oh no, Melon. I'm a freaking squeaker now! What do you mean you're a squeaker? It's embarrassing. Bro, you become a squeaker. I bet you your voice is all high-pitched now. Stop talking about my voice like that! Dude, the frog wasn't even close. What the heck? Why was a squirrel the winner? That's so strange to me. I thought for sure anime would have won out and got the frog in there. What do you think's the best option to dry your hands in a public restroom? Oh yeah, cloth towel roller. Everybody loves when they see that in a bathroom. Yeah, what the heck? even is that? It's paper towel, bro. A cloth towel roller? No, bro, it's obviously the hot air dryer. Wait, it's not paper towel? Dude, you sonny, you should've listened to me. This monkey's gonna throw poo on me! Well, I thought people preferred paper towels. It wasn't asking what's environmentally friendly. What even is the cloth towel roller? I've never seen that in my life. It's just a reusable cloth that you pull, you dry your hands, and then the next person pulls it. Doesn't it run out of cloth? Yeah, and then they have to wash the whole thing. That makes sense. Anyways, Melon. I'm dropping it! Oh, there's nothing in this pool. Yeah, it's right over here, Sonny. Which fictional world would you rather live in? Star Wars, Minecraft, or Harry Potter? I personally think Harry Potter would be the most fun. I'm going Star Wars. Actually, you're right. Star Wars has a whole galaxy that you get to explore. Because you can travel at light speed. Yep, and Star Wars was definitely the right choice. Nah, you for sure died. Let me see when you respawn. I'm telling you, bro. I would never lie to you. You know that I'd never lie to you, right? I don't see you back here. Oh, there you are. <laughs> Dang it! So, do you think it's Harry Potter or Minecraft? 
<laughs> Bro, I honestly have no idea. I'm gonna go with Harry Potter, though. I'm gonna be real. I think it's Minecraft is what people voted. But Minecraft is the worst out of these three worlds. Yeah, you're just a block. At least Harry Potter, you get to do magic. And Harry Potter was the right choice. Let's go. You liar! I am in the most disgusting diarrhea bathroom, and I'm getting attacked by a toilet. Yeah, I got pooped on. Oh my god. That was very unpleasant. I have a toilet paper head now. Minecraft is just like normal world, but worse. But I can fight skeletons and get epic diamonds. Who wants to do that, Sonny? You just get diamonds in real life. Oh, hey, Melon. Yeah, I went the wrong way. It's this way. If you could have any vehicle, what would it be? A sports car, a private jet, or a giant robot? Bro, it's gotta be giant robot. Please tell me this wins. What? Are you serious? How? I don't understand. Now I'm about to be a squeaker. These kids are so stupid, bro. Giant robot is a sports car and a private jet all in one. <sighs> Whatever, it's gotta be private jet then. Time to die again. I'm stuck underwater. What What just happened? Melon, get out of there, bruh. I can't, I'm stuck. Just reset yourself, you noob. How does that even happen? It's cause the rubber duck doesn't float, bro. It sinks you. And the answer was sports car, by the way. Nah, you're capping, brother. You did PJ and I don't see you back there. Did I do PJ? Yes, you did, bro. I'm going down the private. There we go. You tried to cap. My bad. I thought I could pull one over you and make a fool out of you. And Mel and as you approach, I'll ask the question. Which household item would you rather fight? A vacuum cleaner, a toaster, or a blender? Bro, vacuum cleaner. A toaster's gonna fry you up. Blender's gonna cut you up. Vacuum cleaner's gonna, what, do nothing? It's gonna zuck you up. Bro, and it wasn't even the vacuum cleaner. What else are you picking? I think you should select the blender, bro. It's perfect for you. And I just got bowled to death. I feel like you're lying. All right, man. I'm totally lying. I'm gonna try the toaster fight, please. Please, please be good. Yo! Who's fighting a toaster? I'm going to fight a toaster right now. Oh, thank goodness. Melon, the next question. Worst thing to get stuck on your shoe in a public restroom? Toilet paper. That's gross. Yeah, but bubble gum is the worst. If that's stuck on your shoe, you can't get it off. Are you serious? Are these kids stupid? Who's voting? I'm getting pooped on again. Yeah, I'm getting crashed by a pirate ship with cannonballs. I don't know who's setting up these votes, but it wasn't bubblegum and it wasn't wet toilet paper. It was a band-aid. I won't lie, a used band-aid is disgusting, but guess what? It comes off of your shoe real easy. Bubblegum, good luck with that. Exactly, Sonny. Going down the band-aid toilet. Wait, what? Melon, you lied to me! <laughs> it was wet toilet paper the whole time. And now I'm getting donutted by Mr. Homer Simpson. Well, that was a delicious way to die, at least. How is it wet toilet paper? Bro, there's now four tunnels. Four freaking tunnels. We're getting closer, Melon. Best ghost, Slimer, Casper, Pac-Man ghost, or the Snapchat ghost? It's either Pac-Man or Snapchat. I'm gonna go with Snapchat, because I feel like there's a bunch of younger people on here. Did you die? Oh my goodness! It's Casper, the friendly ghost. I'm getting squeaked. Ew, I'm in the clear, let's go. Up next, best magical item. Dorothy's slippers, Peter Pan and Pixie Dust, Aladdin's lamp, or the wizard's wand. Who's the wizard? It's Harry Potter. Okay, okay. Best magical item. I'm gonna have to say it's probably the wizard's wand. Well, I'm gonna say that I'm going down this toilet and I was correct. Dang it! It was the magic lamp with the three wishes, you idiot. I guess it makes sense. I just figured Harry Potter was the most popular one. And I'm not even gonna tell Melon this one. I'm just gonna choose the right answer. This better work, this better work. How are you in this slide? What? That was so weird. We were in the same slide for a second. Really? Yeah. Bro, best Peter. Peter Parker, Peter Rabbit, Peter Piper, Peter Pan. It's gotta be Peter Parker. Dang it, you knew the answer. Let's go. I'm waiting for you, Melon. Let's get a move on here. Eh, yeah, Rain, I'm on my way. Over here. The next question on the toilets. Who's the best fictional detective? Sherlock Holmes, Detective Conan, Shaggy Rogers from Scooby-Doo, or L from Death Note? I'm going with Sherlock. I don't even know who Conan is, so I'm not choosing that guy. Well, I can tell you it's not Sherlock Holmes. You're lying. That's your lying voice. I'm being honest with you right now, Sonny. Fine, then I'm gonna try this. The power of anime compels me. And I'm dead! It's not L! Oh no, that's Pennywise. 
This is this is cursed. I'm dead. I got you so good, didn't I, Sonny? It's Sherlock Holmes, isn't it? <laughs> you <laughs> idiot. <laughs> it's not funny. I can't believe I actually listened to you. Oh, you're such an idiot, Sonny. Whatever, Sherlock Holmes, here we go. All right, what's the best wizard? Dumbledore, Gargamel, Gandalf, or Merlin? It's Gargamel! Dude, it's not even Sherlock, you liar! <laughs> Double lied to you, Sonny! Who was it then? You're not gonna believe it. It's the Detective Conan, the one that I've never heard of. No, it's not him, I'll be honest. It's, uh, it's Shaggy Rogers. You're such a liar, it is not Scooby-Doo. I'm being honest right now, Sonny, listen to me! Fine, Shaggy Rogers, I'll flush myself. Done. I'm dying! What is wrong with you? Bro, quit the cap! Ah, uh, I didn't even go in the toilet yet. I was trying to bait you out. I was trying to see if you'd react. Shaggy Rogers, what the heck, man? Who voted for Shaggy? He's the worst detective. I feel like the best wizards... Oh, bro, it's gotta be Gond. Gondolf the wise. Merlin's beard, Merlin, was it correct? Oh my goodness, you're not gonna believe it, Sonny. It was correct. Stop the cap. I'm getting pooped on right now. No, you're not. You're gonna see me with a poop head any second now. Okay, then I'm changing and voting for somebody else. Please, let me be correct. Let it be Gargamel. Yes! Bro, there's no way it's Gargamel. I don't even know who that is. It's the character from the Smurfs, and Smurf Cat's a big meme. I don't believe it. All right, well, I hope you chose wisely. I picked very wisely, actually. Let's go! You knew it'd be Dumbledore. Dang it. Best fictional ice cream flavor. How is an ice cream flavor fictional? Well, they're just more extreme flavors, like rainbow candy swirl, cookie dough and brownie blast, and chocolate chip pancakes. I hope this is a real thing one day. I need this. I'm gonna go for the rainbow candy swirl. Nah, I bet you it's actually the cookie dough one. I'm pretty sure all of these flavors exist. Oh, I'm getting alligator chomped. Oh, I'm not getting alligator chomped, but I am in a sewer. I know the right answer. It's cookie dough and brownie blast. Oh, it's the rainbow one, I'm telling you right now. I really hope you did the rainbow one. Are you serious? It's actually the rainbow. Yes! Ah! I'm in a bathroom that looks like it got hit with cookie dough and brownie blast. This toilet's gonna kill me! Now, Sonny, what's the best board game? Candyland, Chess, Scrabble, or Monopoly? I'm gonna go with Chess. Most classical board game of all time. I'm dead. That's all I know. Rainbow candy swirl. I can tell you it was not Chess. It's got to be Candyland. I got wiped. I was a poop, and then I got wiped. And now I'm with toilet paper. Gross, brother. It's gonna be Monopoly. It's not a bad guess, Sonny. Everybody knows and loves Monopoly. I feel like everyone knows and really doesn't like Monopoly that much. Well, they've all played it at least. Now, Melon, who is the best fruit? A watermelon? A pumpkin? Oh, okay, it is Monopoly. Dang it, I was trying to start making something up that sounded sus. All right, best alien. Chewbacca, Spock, E.T., or Jar Jar Binks? It cannot be Jar Jar Binks. Everybody hates Jar Jar Binks. Chewbacca. I feel like it's gotta be Chewy. Is it Chewy? No way! I think it's because people don't view Chewy as an alien. Mm -hmm. Let me just make sure and confirm this. I'm dead, bro. And not Chewbacca. I'm not seeing your reason. Oh, okay. I, I, I believe you. Yeah. I'm going with E.T. then. I'm jumping in that turlet with you. Let's go! Now, Melon, there's just a slight question remaining. Who is the best Bob? Best... Bob. Sponge. It's gotta be the sponge. Yep, I'm going with Spongebobber. There's no chance Spongebob loses this battle. Thank goodness. All right, dude, how long does this thing go for? It doesn't end! It doesn't end until we find every toilet. Best dinosaur, bro, where's the T-Rex? Just go for the T-Rex right away. Are you sure? I'm positive. It could be the Velociraptor. No, nope, it's definitely the Tyrannosaurus. Did I do it? Did I beat the game? Going down another toilet. This has got to be it. Yes! Let's go! Victory! I don't really know why we deserve to celebrate a win. All we did was flush ourselves down 52 toilets. I'm going to flush myself down a 53rd. It's time to rebirth. And while Melon's rebirthing in this toilet, can you guys please leave a like on this video and subscribe to Get Goated.